Hey everyone, this is Jack from Victory Camera, here with one of my favorite 35mm SLRs, the Canon AE-1. This was the first film camera that I ever shot with, and even after a few decades in my parents' closet, it still worked great. It's got nice ergonomics and simple, user-friendly controls, which make it a great starter camera. It was produced from 1976 to 1984 in Japan, amidst fierce competition between Canon and the other Japanese camera manufacturers, specifically Nikon. Several advanced features, including the first ever microprocessor in an SLR, plus a big advertising push from Canon, helped them sell over 5.7 million units. It's still one of the highest selling cameras of all time. It was targeted at amateurs, so it was designed to be simple to use and affordable. It's battery powered and its electronic shutter has a really satisfying sound. In fact, it was used by Apple for their original camera sound effect on Macs and iPhones. It's got a self timer, an auto exposure mode that's set on the lens, and its manual mode is shutter priority, which means you set the shutter speed on this dial and then the meter tells you how wide to open your aperture. This is counter to most SLRs which use aperture priority, but I found it to be a really good way to learn manual shooting. This camera is still really popular today and it's easy to see why. It just lets you start shooting without getting in your way. This one has the standard 50mm f1.8, which is a great starting lens, but we've also got a lot of zooms and other primes here at Victory. Head over to victorycamera.com to see what we've got in stock. And if you've been wanting to try shooting film for a while but weren't sure where to start, I can't recommend this camera enough as a starting point. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.